American Air Gun Hunter. I'm down in Texas right now doing a hunt. Um, doing a few hunts actually. I've been down here for quite a while and I'll be bouncing around to a few properties, shooting some different things. Right now I'm at a friend's place up north of Abilene and um, I'm, uh, I'm going to go out and do some hog hunts. I'm going to go out for some big hogs, but this is going to be fun. He asked me if I'd go and get rid of some of the small pigs. He's he has a lot of hunters come through. Everybody tends to shoot the, uh, the, the biggest pig in the group, which is usually the sow. So he's got these herds of orphan, orphaned uh, pigs and wants me to go and cull them. He said they're, uh, they're just getting everywhere. They disturb everything. They eat everything. So anyway, I'm going to, in the mornings, I'm going to walk around and just uh, do a little bit of, uh, of micro pig hunting. They call them footballs here because they're about football shaped. They weigh about 25 pounds, 25 to 30 pounds. So anyway, one of the guns I'm going to take out for this is my FX Maverick. Uh, I love this gun. I've got the uh, 30 caliber barrel on it right now. Uh, if you don't know the Maverick, uh, this is a, uh, a gun that's a, a little bit lower price point than the Impact and takes a lot of that technology over at that lower price point. But uh, I have my Impact and I love it, but I also love this thing. It is portable, it's uh, shootable, ergonomic. Uh, it's got a lot of the same attribu attributes of the, uh, of the impact. Um, great trigger, uh, cocking action, smooth as silk. Uh, regulator is just dead on. This gun is so consistent shot to shot. Um, and uh, it just really does the job. I've been using mostly for, uh, for rabbit hunting and some of the other hunts I've been doing with it, squirrels. I've been using the uh, JSB Exact, the, uh, the 30 caliber pellets. Uh, which weigh uh, 50.15 grain, and uh, they've done a great job. But for these pigs, I wanted to uh, to go with something that had a little bit more penetration. I, I thought so. I, I went to the hybrid slugs. These actually weigh a little less than the um, than the, the uh, exact pellets, but I think with the uh, the Let's see what my guns have to be rugged. <laughs> anyway, uh, the uh, the uh, Hybrid slugs are a little bit lighter than JSP pellets I normally use. Uh, they've got a, a smaller head, and I think uh, that is going to uh, really penetrate well in these pigs. I'm still going to stick the headshots on them, uh, but uh, we'll go out and we'll see how they do. I saw a pig up around the bend in the road up there. I'm going to move down along and see if I can get a shot at him.
So the Maverick did a really good job for me out in the field on this trip. Um, I hunted with it uh, for a few days. And like I said, I've done a lot of small game with it in the past, but this is the first time I went out after something bigger. And granted, these pigs were under 40 pounds, but still they're, they're large for a, uh, a standard uh, air gun. Um, I was using my Maverick Compact. It's the, uh, the version that has a it's the version that has a 300cc um, carbon fiber tank and a 500 millimeter barrel. So it's a really short, compact package. It's easy to maneuver through the, uh, the thicket. Some of the times I was in pretty heavy grass, uh, long grass, which is always a trip while you're out hunting pigs. Uh, and um, it was just really easy to move with and to maneuver. The uh, Maverick has a 16-shot magazine, so it has a, uh, a high number of shots on tap, and it can shoot up to 70 per charge. So, you know, once you fill the bottle, you're out there for an entire day. Even if you're hunting prairie dogs, you probably are only going to have to go back for a refill maybe once in a, in a day in a really target-rich environment. So uh, you have a lot of shots on, on tap, and it's got a high shot count. The, uh, the gun, like, like I, I believe all FX guns, but definitely all recent uh, FX guns, uses the smooth uh, twist X barrel that's proprietary to, um, to, to FX. And it does a real job. I mean, um, these guns are dead accurate with either pellets or slugs. And, and that's another point. So normally I, in this gun, I use either a JSB Exact uh, or I use JSB Hades uh, pellets. But this, uh, this hunt, I used slugs, so I went and sighted in. The gun was dead accurate with the slugs as well. And uh, they performed really well, as you, as you saw in the hunt. That, that pig was at about uh, 50 yards, the headshot. He just dumped on the, uh, the spot. So I was real pleased with the way that they performed. That, that 300cc tank fills to a pressure fills to a fill pressure of about 250 bars. That's about 3,600 PSI. The barrel is fully shrouded, um, and uh, the gun is fairly quiet on its own, but that shroud also is threaded, and in my gun I'm using a Donny FL moderator. And I think Donny FL makes the best sound suppressor systems for air guns that's, that's out there right now. It's uh, really compact, but at the same time it does the job. It's great. doesn't add much to the length of the gun, but does a great job of killing down the sound to being pretty much whisper quiet. That's an overused phrase, but this really is, is pretty, uh, pretty close to it. And again, another thing that you get with this gun that I like with all of the FX guns is that the triggers are just fantastic. So anyway, um, I had this gun out, I carried it, I hunted with it uh, for a larger game. It did a job for me again. I really enjoyed it. And uh, it's a gun that uh, I think, you know, if you're looking for, for that one gun to, uh, to kind of aspire to, because it's not an inexpensive gun, but it's not outrageously priced for what you're getting either. If you want that, that gun to, uh, to aspire to and to be your gun, I think the Maverick is a pretty good, uh, pretty good option. I really enjoy hunting with it.